Hey guys, it's Haps, and in today's video, we are back with Goobies. And I don't really know how we follow up the last run because I'll tell you what, Bingus absolutely popped off. But we do have one more character that we need to try out. So we're gonna jump straight in and we're gonna try Hoozy Woozy. Now, Hoozy Woozy causes the ground to burn, dealing one AoE damage every 0.5 seconds. HP, nine, speed, seven, so pretty solid stats. Damage five, not bad. Rate of fire is pretty good at 0.6 seconds and we have a range of 900. But I think I'm just gonna push the AOE again. I think Hoozy Woozy with some AOE uh, scaling in terms of damage and also size of AOE could be pretty strong, could be pretty strong. So let's jump in and see what we can do with Hoozy Woozy. Oh, look at this. It's actually at like a snake trail. Oh, that's so cool. Wait, so we could just do this? And we surround them. We could just run. Oh, if we just get our speed up, we could just run circles. <laughs> if you'd like to go into the fire, that would be great. Oh, I shouldn't run into them. That's my my bad. Um, okay, so the quicker we move, the more damage we do. That's pretty good. We'll take that. Okay, so I wonder like if you build out the AOE size, whether our snake gets bigger. If you stand still, does it pull around you or does it stay? No, it disappears. But we could do this. Okay, increase your speed, we'll do it. Hoozy Woozy is gonna be running riots. Look at the gaps, like Hoozy Woozy can run into the gaps. I mean, the problem is you have to like give them time. Increase the radius of all AOE. I think I might take explosive blobs. I think I'm just gonna build out some AOE damage. Like if we're running around, we don't give them enough time to walk into it. So we have to like do this and then stand still. So like do this and then stand still. And stand behind it. So like you create a wall and then stand here and then they walk onto it. I think that's kind of how we got to do it. So we create a wall and then you hide behind. I don't know how useful this is going to be. Uh, deal more damage the faster we move. Happy to take some more of this. Yeah, so I'm not really sure how useful this ability is. Um, we probably, I, we seem to be killing more with the projectiles than the actual. Maybe when we get a bit closer, it might be better. We can increase our speed more. I'm going to take more explosive blobs. Wow. <laughs> okay, that worked really well. Our rate of fire is pretty good. So yeah, if we um if we're blowing things up, um I guess we'll take the obliteration here. So let's get this little let's run around with our little streamer behind us. We'll snake in here, and then if we stand still. I think I'm just I'm not, I don't think this <laughs> I don't think this is doing that much. I'm not gonna lie. I don't think this is doing that much. We could take we we'll take this, lose a bit of health, we do a bit more damage. Yeah, I don't think um I think the most of the stuff is happening from the explosions. I think our little our little streak here does a little bit of damage if they come at us. I guess we could do this, like and if they're walking towards us like this, then they'll um we can sort of protect the the area behind us. Just kind of run over the same spot and just create just like this pool. Okay, more exploding fire. Let's let's go. Let's get running around. There's a magnet in there. We'd like to get that. Ghost blobs. The ghost blobs were quite good in the Bingus run, so I think I'll take those. They did some good damage for us. Just kind of provide a bit of uh, fire protection around here. Do this, and then if we stand in the middle. <laughs> yeah, I'm not so sure on this is a bit. Hoozy Woozy's ability is a little bit, well, I don't know. <laughs> maybe, maybe I can make better use of it some other way. Um, I'm going to take. Hmm. 
I'll probably just take some more Halo, to be honest. Increase the damage when things are a little bit tough. Okay, so they kind of are running onto it. I wonder if I'll be able to see the stats on how much damage it actually does at the end. Um, okay, I think we take the exploding fire pool here because enemies have a 50% chance to explode on death dealing pretty much 10 AoE damage and leaving a pool of fire behind. So that combined with my st my streaks here, we could basically just create a lava bed. Okay, there's Gaia. Run around here, nice. Increase damage. We'll do it, we'll increase the damage. The uh, tentacles come down, we're good. I mean, we can't really do that much damage to the boss. That's the thing. Uh, we need some chaining going on here. There's a bit of an explosion. Like we're try <laughs> trying, I'm trying to get as close as I can. I wonder if I can, no, I'm pretty sure that if I run over the top, I'll actually take damage. So I'm not gonna do that. Just keep running around. I guess it's just gonna be a slow progress. Although we've done a bit of damage. We're down to 300 now. Oh, and there it is. There it is. Come on, give us something good. Is impressed by you, that's nice. Okay, so we're gonna have to force a bit of crit then if we're gonna be taking the slash here. Pop, pop, pop. Um, I'm just gonna keep running. I'm just gonna build up the speed. We have more damage with speed, so makes sense. Okay, island one done. Assessment of Hoozy Woozy. Suspect ability. But apart from that, like the base stats are pretty nice. What I kind of wish I'd done is I kind of wish I had put the upgrade of an additional projectile and gone project projectile with Hoozy Woozy. Maybe we can do that in another run. Hmm, we'll take the boomerang. I want more explosions. <laughs> That's what I want. I want to do more explosive damage. So we do this and then Okay, it kind of works. Like if you can't if you can like kind of get them all in one area. Oh, we're just gonna add to the fire. We're just gonna go all out fire. Let's do this. more fire <laughs> just everything is orange okay nice it is a little bit like snake i mean i guess we take this the exploding volcanic pool i think we push this this is this is pretty nice Trap these. And then this should kind of have a little chain of explosions. Nice. I haven't managed to pick up any um, any experience buffs. So yeah, building building the levels is a little bit slower this, this time around than normal. I'm going to take this, deal more damage the faster we are because we're rapid. So I'm just going to push that a little bit more. We've got a good amount of speed. Okay, get up here. So we can we can actually have a look at in-game stats um, by pressing like the middle button. So we can look at these. So we can see that we've already got this pretty well leveled up to five. And then we can actually see our movement speed here. For anyone who plays this game, I just use the middle mouse button for that. But I believe you could probably tab it or something. Let's rotate through here see what we can do there's a bit of a chain there's our ghost doing some work for us the more damage the faster you are i'm just gonna keep pushing this i'm just gonna keep pushing the damage 
because I want to try and basically prepare myself for those elite giants, the ones that just have just so difficult to get through. That's a lonely bit of experience. Take that. Okay, they're popping off. The ghosts do another little extra work as well. Oh, we're definitely taking the salvage energy. This, this is, I mean, we could take fire as well. Both of these are good, but I'm going to take this. Because I know how well it works when it pops. Run through here. Okay, I tried to find the gap. So we've got no no current way of healing other than actually finding the health. Um, so yeah, we've got to keep keep an eye out for the health. You know what? We're gonna go yellow sapphire again. We're gonna go. We're gonna. Oh, we could take. We could increase our attack speed. I don't think this is a bad idea. We've got a good amount of damage right now. I think actually increasing our attack speed is also pretty good because if we can just trigger these explosions more, then that's only going to be a good thing. That is only going to be a good thing for us. Get in here, pick up some of this experience. <laughs> so much fire. Okay, so exploding volcanic pool. Enemies have a 15% chance to explode on death dealing. 25%, oh no, 11.25 plus 25% of their max HP as AoE damage and leaving a pool of fire dealing 2.5 damage every second. The explosion releases five volcanic orbs exploding upon impact. Yep, we'll take it. We're just going to keep pushing this. <laughs> I mean, Hoozy Woozy is a fire lord. Look at Hoozy Woozy go. Oh, you're the one that kind of fires out ultrasonic be like beams no no it's not it's not you that's magnus you fire out yeah these little balls but we got the speed to dodge oh uh, well there we go <laughs> there was me saying we've got the speed to dodge i just walked straight into it could do with some health a way to heal would be nice go around here just trying to pick up so i mean we get the magnet anyway so we might as well take down play you you're on a hundred there it is am am is done come on give us something good a times four a times two is that fire yeah it is the fire lord gets more fire your initial attack has... Uh, we're going to go for the chain. Chain, increasing the chance of fire, explosions. I mean, we're setting up pretty nicely. <laughs> I just love the movement of some of these characters. Look at Hoozy Woozy. Look at those arms. Just look at him go. <laughs> what a great time. In fact, the streak behind actually make Hoozy Woozy look like he's rapid. Okay. Oh, I wonder what the lag will be like with with the trail behind us. Let's draw a line up here and a line here. Okay. Then go back over ourselves and just I'm I'm looking for some health here. You walk onto my fire, thank you. There it is, there's the chain that we're looking for. Um, I'm actually gonna take the keen. Ah, oh, no, we'll take Essence of Zigrid because this actually drops little. This brings down little meteoroids, which could then do that. <laughs> I mean. The explosion there, pretty good. Okay, so these are actually known as queens, not spiders. Um, these little guys are the spiders. The queens are the ones that fire the little projectiles. 
Not projectiles, they're more like bombs <laughs> than projectiles. Okay, I don't think I've found any health so far. We're going to get down here and take you down. 21 damage. Rotate round. Find the gaps. Okay, more damage. We'll take more damage. Happy to push the damage in this instance. There it spreads. It's spreading. The more damage that we can do, the easier it is to kill things, which is means it's easier to take stuff down. We could increase the radius. You know what? I'm actually going to do this. Dealing damage to enemies above 90 HP has a 25% chance to deal 40% more. I think that's good. Like, basically, I want to try and increase the amount of damage that we do because later down the line we're going to be coming up against some of the elite and we need to take them out so that they can explode and for us to get this chain effect if we can't take them out then we're going to struggle so i think i'm just kind of thinking ahead a little bit there wow i'd like 600 okay so here we go we're already coming up against some of these there we go see like if we can get the chain like that that is so nice now we're going to increase the size of the AoE. Oh, that feels so good. So much experience. We still haven't got an experience upgrade, though. So that is probably worth picking up if we find it. It feels quite late now, but... We are only 26. Ah, oh, see, now we get it. But do we take it? Or do we just keep pushing? I think we do take it. I I, I think we do take it. I, a 5% really isn't that much. But then the next one is. And if we don't take this one, then we won't get access to the next one. So, just kind of thinking about that. Okay, there's a, there's a spider mini boss down here. Let's put some fire in front of you. Okay, I got in a little bit of a tight jam there. We need some health. So far, not found any health. More speed. <laughs> it's got to be done. Okay. AoE would be good. Attack speed is not bad. We'll take attack speed. So I'm toying with the idea that if Thick Hide comes up, I take it because I need some way to heal. Um, and finding health is proving to be there's some okay we take the orbs there's the chain that's so nice oh the clear is so good and there's a magnet okay we take more speed more speed is more damage because we've stacked damage quite a bit on our speed So every oh that's so good 400 and we're gonna go boom very shortly oh wait the chain's still going now it's 600 there it is okay clear you just get the damage there then i've just got to be careful like with my speed it, it's very easy to run into them Okay, now we're getting now we've got a good amount of experience here. We should potentially even go up to the next level here. It's very close. We're nearly there. We are there. Okay, we could go wildfire or we could keep going with you. Enemies have a 22.5% chance to ignite an AoE wildfire upon death dealing. I mean, we could take this or we could take this. I think we'll just push the wildfire as well. We are the fire lord after all. We kind of want to max out both. We need more health. So much experience. 
Mumza. Actually, yeah, this is good. Mumza can just run over... Oh, the, yeah, Mumza's the easiest boss to take on. Because it literally follows you. <laughs> just leading Mumza into a path of destruction. Okay, right, we're... We'll just keep running around, see if there's any health that I've missed. I don't think there is. Um, I've got no way of healing either, so... Oh, I just walked straight into... That was that was not necessary. Okay, give us some AoE stuff. Okay, crit's not too bad. The, the crit chance actually not too bad, because we have a couple of the... Um, I believe we picked up some of the slash. Okay. On to the next one. We've got 4 HP. So, staying alive is goal number one. 13,000 kills. So, we want to try and get as much HP as we can find. I'm going to take down some of these. Okay, we're looking for HP. Just try and stay clear of everything. Watch the projectiles. We're just going to concentrate here. A little bit more than we have done. Because I want to avoid losing any more HP. But we want to find some. So we're on 4.1. So let's see if we can avoid losing any more. Maybe taking down this boss. Which is sort of what we're trying to push. The crit's coming in really nice there. You're gone. Okay. Let's get the AoE. Attack speed. Okay. We're, 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 we're happy with some attack speed. get a chain watch that nice wildfire yep we'll take it big explosion there's the chain some ghosts out there doing some work for us we're down to four another chain we're gonna get another chain as well The chains are wild, actually. Okay, we can just keep chaining. Um, or Actually, no, we'll go orb. We're going to push the orbs. We're going to push the experience here. There's some health. 2,000. Okay, we're out of enemies. We're out of... Uh... I think we take this, you know. We've picked up a fair bit of crit chance. And I think that'll help kill enemies and start the explosion chains. We're up to 6 HP, so we're a little extra HP would be nice if we can get it. So another another health orb would be good. Oh, I just walked straight into that. That's 5.6. Cheap HP given away. That's what we want to try and avoid. 5.1. It's actually really tricky not to not to run into things just because of the speed of Hoozy Woozy. Whoa, where did they come from? Oh, we actually, that works so well. We blocked them off and there's some health for us up to 7.1. That's really nice. And the chain keeps going and there's more health for us. Okay, we're back up to pretty much full health. I'm going to rotate around and pick up some of this experience. We could keep pushing wildfire or we could push you. I think we'll take the wildfire here. Okay, 9.1. We need some help. Should hopefully start a bit of a chain reaction. Okay, the chain reaction from the fire is actually really, really nice. It is really, really good to see. Who's he woozy, honestly? The Fire Lord himself. Oh, didn't see you there. So yeah, what we... Oh, there's a, quite a few. We've got to be careful here. We need to set the chain reactions off. Just a little bit of health. Good. Just collect up all of this. 
I definitely think picking up those, the experience orbs when I did was a good idea because now it does feel like it's worth it. I'll tell you what, I need to get the, I need to get it working so that I can use my controller because like doing an hour of running ground constantly like this in a, in a run, although we've only 20 minutes so far, is uh, kind of kind of hard work on the old uh, the old wrist. <laughs> Clear you, nice. The orb duplicator, we're we're taking that. We're we're locking that in. We want the experience. Okay. Let the chain reaction happen. Then we'll be in here to. Do the next. Oh, your beam. I forgot about you. Magnus. Sneaky. That's actually painful as well. I remember it being quite... Quite painful. Um, health. Oh, we're at max health. That's so nice. Okay. Not at max health anymore. rotate round these little these these big balls that are like around the edge kind of kind of difficult to play around we can't do that much damage on magnus it's quite tricky A little bit stuck here. Okay, now we've got. Now we're doing some damage. There we go. That was a good little. That was a good little section. Kind of focusing on Magnus right now. But we, yeah, we're not doing that much. It's. And now, uh, yeah, we needed to pop that and get up there. Okay, right, nice. Take round. Just playing pretty close to the chest here. Trying to, trying to stay close without getting in the way or causing myself too much pain and getting trapped. There we go. There we go. We got it. Nice. Come on. Give us something good. A times four would be awesome. A times two, but times three wildfire. The fire lord knows what he wants. Magnus delivers. Who's he? Woozy. Okay, let's rotate round, pick up the last few scraps before the end. Okay, nice. So 26,000 kills. Boom. <laughs> and there it is. Take down that, and then you guys are going to run into all of this another chain reaction let's get you guys pinned in here okay now this is where it pops we'll take the magnet uh we keep doing more damage for our speed or we can chain i think we're chained now okay we're gonna get another combo going here and then we're going to tr want to try and be in the middle of these two groups. Boom. There we go. And then we get an... Oh, we didn't... We did nothing with that second one. Okay. Let's try and get the... Uh, get, get the combo going. Watch out for you. These guys just get the fire. Good amount of damage. Taking a bit of a hit though. Loving the experience. 
the queens are the just dropping these bombs on us is actually quite tricky let's get in here with some fire see if i can nice okay that did very little that that second one <laughs> oh the explosion wait did we just pick up all of that experience straight away or did it just disappear into the ether <laughs> I think we'd take the keen slash. I think this is because each critical strike has 40% chance of causing up to four slashes on a close by enemy, dealing 75% of the damage dealt. So we can just keep, basically keep just slash, like the critical damage is also chaining. Okay, this is a thousand, then another big hit. And we're going to do another one as well. So difficult not to run into the enemies honestly with the amount of speed that I have watch these hopefully do enough damage here start the chain reaction watch out for these no well don't come into my fire don't really want to be in the middle because if I get trapped in the middle then it's bit of a problem so we need to set off a bit of a chain reaction here to get out of this oh these are the these are the elite dudes with the okay yeah these these guys are tricky oh we'll rotate around trap these guys in Okay, it's doing a good amount of damage. I mean, they, they, they're they quite hefty. <laughs> These guys are hefty. They uh, they take a lot of damage to do anything on. Um, oh, wait. The, the dude is the one that kind of, like, draws you in. Do not like this guy. No, go away, go away, go away, go away. How do I get away? I can't actually go down here. We're just gonna have to rotate around the outside and run. Okay, we haven't got much health. Can we find some health? I can't believe we've not found like, um, we've not picked up hide or anything like that. I think we just keep, I mean, just keep taking this. Is it, I don't think this is improving anymore, is it? We'll take this though, more speed. problem I have here is one I'm a little bit too quick whoa that's so close that little tentacle dude is a real problem I need some health I we, we need when we take down these I'm praying for like thick hide that's what I'm praying for Oh, that's a painful. Just be careful here. Watch out for you. Dodge these. Find this gap here. I need experience. Okay. I feel like I am sort of hanging on with health here um, because I've got no way of healing other than finding it and if we don't find it then we have a bit of a problem oh we taken down Ula nice that is not that's triple frost bolt kind of goes against the fire lords philosophy the frost but hey we'll uh, we'll take it <laughs> Clear you, nice. Oh, this good, good bit of experience over here. Rotate round, watch, dodge all of these. Yeah. 
Okay, I'm gonna do. We've done a fair bit of damage. Can we find that gap? We can. Okay. Get a tri Oh no, we're down to 1.2. Dodge that. Dodge that. We need that. We need to get out of here. We need health. We need health. We need to take down a man, and we need health. <laughs> and we need to get thick hide. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, it's so difficult to dodge. It really is. Oh, 0.4. Oh, that's so close. There it is. Okay, we got it. Let's let's clear the wave. I don't know how much further Hoozy Woozy is going to go. Just going to rotate round. Surely we take you down here. Nice. Okay. Come on. We need the thick hide. No, the boomerang. Okay. Well, we're taking it. And we're going in with 0 0.4 HP. <laughs> Hoozy woozy. This could be your last stand, my friend. But let's go. Okay. I'm praying for... Some, oh, we're taking the thick hide straight away. Anything that's going to give us a potential to get some health, we're taking it. And I'm just going to play very slow and very careful. I'm looking for health. We've not found any. No early health. Could be That could be GG for us. Yeah, there it is. There it is. There's not much we could have done there. I mean, I guess we could have just been a better at dodging. <laughs> I guess we could have been better at dodging. But there's our first take of Hoozy Woozy, the Fire Lord. I mean, the exploding volcanic pool does 2.7 million. That did 2.7 million of our damage. Let's just have a quick look through, see if there's anything else that did. 200,000 here. 44,000. I mean, the salvage energy do 2.4 million. 1.7 from the wildfire. Yep, there it is. It was the 2.7 from the exploding volcanic pool. Okay, let's jump out. Let's see what we get from the upgrades. We get another 480, or roughly speaking, to spend. But there we have it. We've been through every single character that there is. I mean, my next... My next play is to try and unlock some of these artifacts or even just to try something like Full Spectrum where you spawn as a random gooby when the game starts as well as one when you go through those portals. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. If you have an idea of what you want to see next, maybe it's unlocking some of these artifacts, maybe it's trying one of these runs, maybe it's just trying to get the highest score I could possibly get. Let me know down in the comments, but thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.